guys welcome to my channel or welcome back to my channel today me and Megan are gonna be opening some plant mail ow nugget <laughs> nugget that hurt so bad why'd you do that I'm just gonna get started right away because I don't really know what to say so first package is from SLF Tropics, and I don't remember what this stands for, but it's from uh, Phoenix Couch, I think, is who the uh, person is for this company. I don't know what you call it. And I think from her I got a... I don't remember. Honestly, I ordered from so many people in the last week. I do not remember who I ordered from or what I ordered from who... So this is kind of a surprise. Nugget, are you so excited? Look at Nuggies. Um, also this package was like a nice little box and it arrived in pretty good condition. So there's that. More of this stuff, just like last time. More of this uh, stuffing. Here's the little guy. I don't remember what it is. <laughs> it's in a cup in a little plastic baggie with some of this on top. And whatever this is, it's super tiny. It's all up in this little cup <laughs> there is some paper over the top of it some uh oh yeah oh this is a monstera dubia duh of course i ordered this oh my gosh easy 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 it's so cute okay so monstera dubia is a shingling type plant uh that's the growth habit of it so i have this little cutting it has two leaves they're perfect it is so cute it looks like it's like i mean it's rooted like it's supposed to be like the roots just kind of come off of the stems at every like in between the leaf nodes there's roots because they not only root into the soil, but they also grab onto things like aerial roots um, to help it like climb up trees and stuff like that. So it's a shingling plant. That's what most of them are like. So that's what this is. It's a little Monstera dubia cutting and it looks perfect, perfect condition. Oh, oh God. Hopefully this thing doesn't have coronavirus on it because I just rubbed my face all over it. Oh my god, I just want to cry right now. I have been wanting one of these for so long. Okay, it's not really that long, like a couple months. It seems like forever though because they're so perfect. Like, as soon as I saw one of these, I was like, oh, I need that. But they're always so expensive. And I finally was like, I'm just going to do it because I don't think it's going to get any cheaper. So, I was like, yep. Gotta do her, gotta do her. So, this puppy is probably going to go... Actually, I think this weekend probably okay so this video will probably be uploaded Wednesday like normal but I'm actually filming on Friday it's Friday right now um but so this weekend which is before the video will be uploaded um I think I'm gonna go down to like the creek near me or a lake and see if I can find some cool driftwood and like plant this right at the base so hopefully it will climb up it in my um paludarium for my frog so yeah or something like that I don't know I want to put it in there I might not be able to have it in the soil because it's pretty wet in there I might have to have like a little container that's a little bit drier above it I don't know I'll have to see but yeah so I'm super excited about this guy hopefully that's in the viewfinder and in focus for you guys oh it's so pretty I love shingling plants I'm obsessed with them if anyone has some shingling plants that you just like to sell me or I mean not sell me send me for free <laughs> please do that thank you so much phoenix this is a beautiful cutting i love this slf tropics also just like last time i'm gonna leave the contacts for every um seller person in the description below also mike's please sponsor me okay next whoa whoa sorry nugget did i touch her tail Oh, I am so sorry, Nugget. Whoa. Whoa, Nuggies. Are you vicious? Come here, Nugget. Are you being so vicious? Here, Nugget. Hey, Nugget, look at this. Hey, Nugget, look at this. Nugget, look at. Look at this, Nugget. 
What's that? Nick it. <laughs> okay. You just don't care anymore? Alright, be nice. Be nice to me, Nugget. Oh, okay. I love Nugget so much and she hates me and I don't understand why and it makes me so sad. Anyways, next package, I think there's two plants in here, I'm pretty sure, from Hannah Kelly. And I don't remember if she has a, um, oh God, Nugget, you got hair on me. Um, a business, oh God, I hear dirt flying around in here. It sounds like there's not really much packing in here. It sounds kind of empty because I can just hear dirt like going around. I think these scissors are dull. Wow. Oh boy. There we go. Should have got a knife, I guess. Oh boy. Oh boy. I opened it upside down. Okay. This is going to be a little bit sketchy for sure. Hold this up so you guys can see what's going on. So here's plant number one. Whoa! Ah, there's dirt falling out of it. Ugh, I hate drinking and burping carbonated things. I hate carbonation. If drink, or I mean, if Mike's wasn't carbonated, it would be perfect. Oh, okay. This is a jewel. Or oh, holy crap. Okay, I've had a few mics. I'm lit. This is a jewel orchid. Jewel orchids are amazing. There's a lot of different varieties and I think they're all beautiful. This reminds me of the, oh. Oh, oh, this guy has a, oh, this guy has a flower on him. That's what's happening. Okay, hold on here. Whatever kind of stuffing this is, I'm also a quilter, if you guys didn't know. And I'm very familiar with different battings and stuffings. This one is really weird though. I've never, like, okay, I'm gonna be honest with you guys real quick. No judging. My couch is secondhand. It's like pretty old, I feel like, because there's no stuffing left in it basically. And it's like this. And when I first got it, Nugget found a dead mouse in it. She like crawled up underneath the couch into the cushions, found a dead mouse, and then pulled it out and was like trying to eat it. And I'm sorry, I just swore. Um, but Nugget, don't eat that. Don't eat that doobie nugget. Don't eat that. That's not for you, silly girl. That's not for kitties. Um, but yeah, this is like the stuffing in the couch that Nugget found the mouse in. So it's kind of grossing me out right now, honestly. But um, so here's this baby. And <laughs> okay, she's not in great shape. Oh, oh man. Okay. I know what I just tried to say, but you guys probably don't. The flower doesn't have much scent, but oh, it's broken in two places. It's a beautiful baby. I didn't really care about the flower though. Like the flowers are insignificant to me. I love the leaves of these guys. Honestly, right now, I'm just gonna clip the flower off. I'll see if I can put it in water or something so it's safe for later, but here's the flower. I don't know if the camera's focusing on this or whatever but here's the plant so there's different types of jewel orchids this is one and the leaves are amazing they look like they're black with like pink neon in them like neon signs you know like they're just amazing so i'm gonna take this um paper towel and tape off the top of this and see what the roots are like because it's like really flopping around in here so I feel like the roots aren't that established okay and <laughs> yeah there's like virtually no roots on here okay I'm just gonna hope that this guy survives good thing I just cut the flower off of it because flowers are wasted energy don't worry I will take good care of you hopefully you like me so there's these two spots of dirt coming off the stems and i'm assuming there's some roots forming in there i don't want to peel it off though because it seems really fragile so i'm not going to try and scrape the dirt away and see if there's uh roots but for now i'm just going to plop this back in the soil and honestly i'll probably put it straight into my paludarium um tonight or tomorrow morning just so that it's in some nice moist soil and can have a better chance at forming its roots but yeah so this baby is beautiful thank you hannah hopefully she formed some roots in the flower on this thing oh the flowers are so cute nugget do you like that come here niggies 
Come on, Nigga. Nigga, come here. Whoa, what's that, Nigga? What's that? <laughs> what is that thing? Oh, does that taste good? Do you like that? <laughs> what is it, Nugget? That smells nice, huh? Do you like that? Yeah, that smells so nice. Here you go. Uh-oh. Whoa, Nugget, it's on your head. What happened? Don't eat it, Nugget. Okay, so anyways, here's a jewel orchid. I feel like I just spent like 15 minutes on that one plant, but my time perception is also like really off because I'm drunk, so I don't know. Oh, Paper leaf nursery. That's Hannah's thing. Oh, she wrote me a note. Okay, so she said this next plant, which is a um, Sissus. Sissus? I don't know if that's how you say it, honestly. I've never had or even seen one of these in real life. Um, so I think it's called a Sissus. I'm not sure which variety it is because there's a few different varieties. I think this is the discolor. I'm pretty sure this is discolor. Um, but she said they can be really picky shippers. So if a couple leaves fall off, just don't worry about it. Just keep it in low or like indirect light, um, good humidity, and even soil moisture. Nugget, calm down. You don't need to be mean right now, Nugget. And this was the one, like, I've been searching for a really nice jewel orchid, which this thing is huge and amazing for the price. I'm so excited about this, but I'm really excited for this because I think it will do really well in my paludarium, which I was talking to Hannah and she thought that it would too, which is uh, the seller. Um, so I'm really excited for this guy. And this one is shipped bare root, it looks like. Oh, it looks nice. Oh, it looks fine. Okay. Let's see. Let's see. And I've heard this from another person. I actually ordered two of these, two different varieties, but one from another seller. And he said the same thing, that they can be really picky shippers. So right now, it didn't lose any leaves coming out of the packaging. It looks like it's shipped bare root in some damp moss. Um, it's got some really nice new growth points on it and actually has like three different shoots coming off of this one plant. So this is a really healthy guy. Nugget, are you so excited? Come here, Nugget. What do you think of this guy, Nugget? Hey, Nugget, look at this guy. Do you like that? That is nice, isn't it, Nugget? No, Nugget doesn't like this one. She really loves the orchid. She keeps going back to that flower. Does that taste good, Nugget? Hey, come here, you. Nugget, does this taste good? Come here. Boop. Boop. Come here, Nugget. <laughs> Whoa, Nugget. You are so vicious. Whoa. It, and she's just eating that flower. So I guess I'm not going to put it in water. I guess Nugget will just eat it. <laughs> um, yeah, so this is a Sissus. Sis, how do you? Sissus? Sissus? Is that how you say it? It seems really weird to say when you see it, like the word, it looks normal, but it's really weird to say. Someone please tell me if that's not how you pronounce it because it seems weird. And I hope that's not the way you pronounce it because it makes me feel uncomfortable and I don't know why. But this guy is beautiful. And he has some really nice tendrils here coming off the ends. Oh yeah, he wants to grow. He wants to grow bad. Honestly, I'm probably going to put these in my paludarium as soon as I quit this video. Because I am so excited. And the moss in here actually seems really dried out. So I probably will plant this guy tonight just so he doesn't get super dry. A couple of the leaves are getting kind of crispy on the ends, I can see. And this was like three days shipping, I think. Like it took like two or three days to get here, I think. So not too bad. Definitely priority shipping. But um, yeah, this is a beautiful plant. And I want to say she sold this to me for $10. I don't remember exactly. I think that's what it was though. I don't know, but I'm super excited because I've never had one of these. I've never seen one. I don't really know anything about them, but they seem really cool. I love viney and shingling plants, like things that crawl up stuff and crawl all over. I love those. Like I'm obsessed with terrariums and my paludarium right now. Hey, nugget, <laughs> nugget, you don't eat that. Hey, nugget, it's a plant. You just look at it. You don't eat it. The only plant you're allowed to eat is grass, remember? Hey, don't bite. <laughs> Nugget really likes this one. It's nice and floppy, stuff for her to play with. Boop, 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 boop. Nuggies, you're so cute. Come here. 
show everyone how cute you are. Say hello, my name is Naked and I'm the cutest baby ever. Right, Nikki's? You are the cutest girl ever. Okay, there you go. Hey, here's a nice box for you, Nugget. Do you want to go in there? No. Lost all interest in boxes since there's plants now. Plants and boxes are Nugget's two favorite things in the entire world. Including me. She hates me, actually. <laughs> I just want to squish her all the time because she's so cute, but she hates being held. She hates getting any attention, really. These leaves are so soft and velvety. Oh my god, I love this thing. I cannot wait to see this thing grow. I am like freaking out a little bit right now because I just want this thing to grow. I hope it does good. I'm so excited to put these guys in my paludarium. Okay, what was the first plant that I opened again? Wait, I got it back here. Oh yeah, Dubia. Monsteria Dubia. Oh, this was amazing. Okay, so this is Monsteria Dubia and a Jewel Orchid, which is called, um, let's see. Ludicia discolor. That's the scientific name of this jewel orchid, in case you're wondering. And again, here's the flower. It's uh, It got broken in shipping, and Nugget ate a couple of flowers off now, but this is the flower. What is that, Nugget? She loves this thing. What is that? <laughs> and again, most orchids... Oh my god, my nose is itchy. Most orchids are grown for the flowers, but jewel orchids, I love the leaves. I do not care about the flowers one bit. Oh, also, I should tell you guys about this just because I'm so excited. Um, there was a plant purge, I think it was last night. I don't think it, it was either last night or this morning. Honestly, I can't remember right now. Um, but it was an orchid purge. And it was all leafless orchids, which I did not know were a thing until I saw this. And I had known this purge was coming, so I was so excited. Um, oh, I can't remember who sells them. But anyways, leafless orchids, they're roots. They're just the roots, and then they'll shoot up flowers. They don't have any leaves. Like, oh my god, they're so cool. They're they're an um, epiphytic plant, so they grew they grow in trees and stuff like that like in the rainforest um but they're an epiphytic orchid and i am so excited because i ordered three different ones it was buy two get one free he was doing an awesome purge there were several different varieties and a lot of options and oh my god i was so anxious because i wanted to have them all and i didn't know what to pick and it was just like madness, like my brain was going crazy for that one hour or whatever it was. But I'm so excited to get those because they're going to be awesome in my paludarium. I think they'll really love it in there because I have an LED light. Um, not a lot of natural light, like maybe two hours a day of natural light. And then they have an LED light that's going 24-7 and I missed in there a lot. So I think they'll really like that. Um, so yeah. I'm really excited about that. And then these three guys I plan on putting in my paludarium also, which this um, quarantine has got me like really buying a lot of plants, which I should not be doing. And like, I hate myself, but I also love myself because I just, I love plants so much. But like, also I know I need to save money for the future, but I just love plants so much and I can't help it. And, like, when you're just sitting on your couch 24-7, what are you supposed to do? Like, duh. Obviously, I'm going to buy plants. So, yeah. But, oh, shoot. I might have broke this guy. I don't know if that happened in shipping or if I just did that. It looks like it might have happened in shipping. But it also has an air root right there, so I might just cut it and uh, root it. And then I have two plants. Um, but, yeah. So, I have more plants coming. And... I ordered like all of these the same, like within the same three to six hours probably, but some people were waiting to ship for certain reasons, whether it be weather or personal reasons or whatever. So I'm gonna be getting some stuff this weekend or next week. So I'm gonna make a couple of these videos probably and then just upload them in the next few weeks every Wednesday. Um, or if I just get insanely bored, which I have been, I might, um, upload two videos a week instead of one every Wednesday so I might do like Wednesday and Sunday or something like that um, 
we'll just see how it goes but i plan on doing an unboxing video every time i receive some plants which like i said it's friday right now and i'll be getting two packages i think tomorrow one or two packages tomorrow i'll try and do another video tomorrow or film another another video um and then i have a couple shipping out this weekend and monday so then i'll have some in the upcoming days too so we'll see how the uploading schedule goes i don't know i'll keep you guys up to date obviously but you can count on every wednesday for sure still but um yeah so if you guys like this video if you guys love mics like i do uh give this video a thumbs up hit the subscribe button leave a comment let me know what you think about this kind of video and if you love these three plants as much as i do because i'm obsessed with these i can't wait to see them grow and just to plant them in general um and hit the bell icon to get notifications from me and i will see you next week or maybe sooner bye